To create the box pleated skirt, first we are going to create two patterns one for a waistband and one for the pleated skirt pattern. To do so, I'm going to come over here to the rectangle tool, click on it to select. Then I'm going to click one on the page to bring the great rectangle window and I'm going to type in the waist circumference. One fourth of the waist circumference is 15.7. Then I'm going to press on the tab key and type in 55 for the skirt length. Next, I'm going to come down here to number of shape and select two. As you can see over here on the preview, we see two pattern pieces. I'm going to click on OK to confirm. After that, I'm going to switch my tool to transform pattern tool over here. Click on it to select and click on that pattern and drag them down just like that. Maybe a little bit over here. Okay, next I'm going to switch my tool to edit pattern tool over here. Click on it to select, hover the mouse to the right and select the edit pattern tool. Now I'm going to click one right here on this top line right there and right click. Then I'm going to select offset as internal line. This allows me to bring in this offset as internal line window and I want to change that to 5 centimeter. After that, I'm going to click on OK. By default, that line is selected. I'm going to right click and select cut. Perfect. Now I'm going to delete this pattern that we don't need. To do that, I'm going to switch my tool back to the transform pattern tool. Click on it. Then click one on that pattern piece. Then press on the delete or backspace on the keyboard to delete. So as you can see, now we created a waistband pattern here, as well as this one fourth of pleated skirt pattern.